covering Cave. They're going to try and chase him down, and they will secure that kill. They're waiting on Yakindar to try offer up the goods, oh, and now God. he's got to do it all alone. 1v3, but they don't know where he is. And so oh Yakindar's my. playing the long game. Nice. Yakindar, right where they want him. And now just, just next to left to beat, and he hears him. All the oh. info there for Yakindar as he lights up the server. That's the Yakindar round right there. For Maus, past this point, it is seemingly impossible. Oh, dare I say that. There I speak too soon, I do. But Jimmy in a 1v4, not long for this world. <laughs> he's whittling everyone down, but he's so low himself, he can't do a thing here. He was just looking for the money, really, for Maus. Oh, the cello. Cello just wasting his time. Oh, oh, wait, oh, wait, the crazy crazy shot. Win. Hang on, backstab him from he's done it. He's done it. He's won the round! That is madness! Hannah volunteers himself up as tribute. He goes in first. And, well, they were meant to trade that, but oh. <laughs> it's not gone well, has it? Twists. He's having a great day. Finally. There's the ace! We've had so many nearly aces, and it's Twists to finally get one! They get rid of an exit, and so now monesty has got to fly solo. 1v3. Orp out, oh, and no. Twists forced into it. Monacy knew that swing was coming. He could hear the tag. It's one kill in the right direction. Skulls can swing off of the Orp contact. Monacy uh -oh. grabs one. And now he's on for a round. Now he's on for a 3K. Clutch up against the AWP. He spotted Kadian earlier on that jump. Eventually, he has to cross for the bomb. Kadian knows he has the kill in his sights, but Monacy ah! wins the round. Damn, Torshi, he's smooth with it right now. Off the hut, in the door, up the vent, in your head. Oh, simple style, baby. Likely he clears Captain Mo here. Oh, but he did, and now a 1v1 emerges. Can Captain Mo come up clutch? Bro goes down, clean headshot from Captain Mo, and a second round on the board for Steel Helmet. But to get this smoke in in time, that is a bit of an issue. Util comes out now, and G2 are essentially faced with this task of do they want to go through? They kind of have to. Now, the whole play hinges on it, so this is very oh, well counted, boy. and the dualies light up G2. Uh, yep, Kickson has heard you. What a horrible way for this to go down for Kadian. There's no way he's clearing this. I say that with such conviction. I have no idea, do I? But, yeah. Uh, I, yo, yeah. yo. Yo, the old stabbing the new. That is cruel. Rings right now. Puppeteer backed away into two. Nexa first point of contact. And maybe the last thing oh. they see as well is Nexa lays waste to Team Liquid with Monacy by his side and some uh, towards this side of the map. Break. Even going to break that smoke open. Oh. We'll feed Hunter, but uh, Nico okay. rather there to put up a defense, to lock this one down single-handedly. It's all Nico. Is he really on for the ace? Not gonna get it, of course, as Nexa hounds down that last man, but... A lot of info and space. Well, that Molly's trouble on B. They're coming in. They're up. Look at this little gap they forged between the smokes. That's a big shot from G. He delivers, takes down Cello. He's cooking up trouble. That's a, oh, a lovely gap, though. They're making this nightmare oh. fuel. As a double kill from Art with only four HP to spare. He's opened up the B side. There is a rotation, but look at this. They're, they're restraining themselves. They're not committing. The smoke swings on through. Needed that one from Amelia. Another low HP on the Yuri. Emilia's doing everything with this low HP. Another double kill impact round, but it's not over if Art can clutch up. He certainly could. He does! What a round out of Art! The quad kill. The half by win. And what a time to come alive, even Nerds. It's ever so reliable, ever so consistent in his fragging ability, and he finds a round out of nothing the same way Martin Aza just did round prior. But that one, arguably even more impressive. Half by an ace and a clutch to close it to. The AK of Khan out in the open. Risky Bob swings through, finds his shot, and it's onto Brokey. Knows where both of them are, but no kit on his back. Time running out. Looking for at least one of these players. He's found the first. There's a kit on the floor, picks it up, sticking the defuse. Khan, is he going to swing? He is. And Brokey, he doesn't fall for it, finds the kill.
And that's going to be 13 for FaZe. They take the map. Parallel between G2 and Wildcard. These nades are relentless. Oh. Oh. And Jame is unstoppable. Oh, oh, he even goes for the wall bank and connects it as well. Oh, Jame! Oh, you're bullying them, Jame! You are bullying them out of banana! Someone's out the bomb at least. Yeah, Art's holding this oh. angle, covers him, nails the headshot into Amelia. They do clear him all the same. Did it. You've got to hold it. Zach has got to hold it. It's up to Starry. He can shoot! He can shoot! It's going to be ah. close. I don't is know that roll? This is going to be close. I'm looking it? right now. This is close. They don't have it. They don't have it. G getting one, two, three, four, five steps ahead of him with the yell. It felt like there was multiple seconds still required on that defuse. Lack of utility to flush him out there. He's going to have the perfect position just to take the fights he pleases. First is his. Trying to dodge out the bullets so easily. Done against the Tech 9 flip. Really pull things back in favor of Heroic. Give them momentum to start off this second half. That was a very scrappy pistol round. But in the chaos in the carnage, they kind of beat 9Z at their own game. Yeah, Martinez are very, very close here. I think indeed did run out a bit of ammo, but either way, really, really cleanly done by Heroic. Advantage Tai Lu. Jim Fat trying to fight forward, knowing that they need to find this initial kill, get the space while the smoke's still up, and he's able to find it. They come out through the smoke, but it doesn't matter for Jimmy. Eventually is run down, leaves it onto the IGL. Mercury low, falling to his death. And it leaves it onto Jam Young around the pillar, but he can't get past Shu8. Wins out the oh. 1v2 with the world helping him for one. Holding the line. Barrel seen. And he's ripe to get this one, is Monacy. They try to double swing him, but that second player out through Boiler won't get there in time. And so that one's free. Monacy just going through the motions on this orb, but he's having a field day. Third kill in the round. It's all Monacy. And now the next is given a chance to get involved. This one gets closed out cleanly. G2 right back to it. Uh, this is now asking a lot from Kadian on T side, right? G2 had the same difficulties, just getting in. And even though Liquid have a flash in the pan, eco round win, consistency is going to be hard. I've seen the eco wreak havoc in this exact position. So let's see if he's up for the task. One kill from Nico. Why not the double? Just KD and left to deal with. And Nico lights up Team Liquid. That's now two in a row for G2. Impressive on his watch. He still is, actually. He's fighting forward quite a lot, and the whole entirety of Namiga swing in front of him. Garrigan can't do anything about it. They're in. That's B-side proving to be a bit of an issue for FaZe. Brookie trying to be the hero, but it's Flammer setting them alight with three in this round. Spam kill from Tessus. Yeah, that's a nice start. The Kinder watching from the sidelines now. Just holding these real tight lines. That's going to flash, I think, in towards Cave. Oh, he's missed it. That's, that's awkward, isn't it? Cadian goes down, not blind was Tessus. 12th frag found. He's on for more here. The multi-kill master racks himself up a triple, just like that. A quad kill in the round. Kicks and denies his ace. He's not going to be happy with that, but that was beautiful. It's a little salty for them. Oh, the, the nade stack on the Molotov. Skulls is about to feast as well. Three, four, and two oh. little shots. But Kadian saves the day better than letting his teammate fall. And that is a very ambitious spray. Double from Yakinda. Twist puts another in the grave. And what's going on here? Heroic look. Uh... They are pressing to take away all of these investments. Saved AWP would be tidy and AK as well. Oh, oh good. Good work from Shush to at least get the information. Perhaps an overstep. Yukinda takes it down. And Nika Doss as well. No way. Ready for it. And that completely breaks the money. Shuhei knows it. He wants to get involved. He wants to farm up some cash instead. Go straight into the USPs. And they found three kills immediately. This is completely not what Mao's expected. Now Yimfat's not ready for connector. Good adjustments. Wouldn't need to find even further damage. But the bomb's been dropped. Roland remains and suddenly... Uh, it's getting a little bit sweaty in the temple right now. G2's filtering through the spawn. They've got no kit. Smoke can come through from Hooksy. They need to hurry up. Yeah, one kill off the dollies. Hooksy continues to move in. 
And it's Nafly to step up and rise to the occasion. No more for Naf. Down to the 1v1. Monacy won't get given the fight, and instead it's all Yakinda. Nice, boys. Great. They went 6 0 up. They closed it out after you know losing six rounds in a row uh, in that first half. But it, it still looked like a comfortable game for Liquid. And uh, let's be realistic with this team, not just with expectations, but also with what we've seen. This team has accomplished absolutely nothing since its inception. The only thing they've done. Hectic start, skulls another. Look at this, there's already three of them there. Twist gets three. As easy as that R completely destroys the commitment. G2 aren't going to have an act of God again. This time they've got to get through KD and ZWP. Nails that first. Any more from the orb. Oh, KD and we're walking so over the cool. line. And ends were clear. <laughs> Me too. Bomb ticking. Bomb's about half gone on this retake. Axile's orping. Perfecto's orping. Okay, they're, they're taking the mickey, aren't they? The execute. Next out aggressive out of cave. Disconnected from that B defense, but they have the rotation point of Inns. Oh, not again. This time Vexlight's the one to draw it with Inns' help. And it, oh! Dexter, that was disgusting. They're executing into Fallen. Are they going to flash? No, they're not. <laughs> no, he hasn't. Starry, good for the frag and converts onto Keserato. And oh, it was almost a double. He nearly had the collapse there. One to the knee of West Melon. Starry, full HP. Got a plan now, boys. Smokes are clearing. Yeah, 10 seconds. This is getting awkward. Westman, do you know he's got the bomb? Well, nice shot from Starry. Uh, bomb's lost. The round is lost. At least he doesn't die afterwards. There you go. You'll take that.